grilled chicken, broccoli, and lots of cheese. Don't forget everybody that during this competition, it is a voting competition for half of the half of the prizes. So don't forget to come to the table where there are people sitting and there are pieces of paper and pieces of paper. Randy, but I'm really not Randy. And I have a lot of ethnicity in my family and I love ethnic food. It was absolutely delicious. So thank you. Alright, this guy's got to talk like Sam and Simon. Can you do it? Accent. Accent. British. Accent. British. Yes. <laughs> British. You can do it. You can do it. Yeah, I like all the uh, salad. It was quite super. <laughs> <laughs> I liked all the flavors of it and the very unique uh, use of the raw green chilies. I assume they're raw. Everything was nice and crunchy in the salad. It was great. Uh, it was a great uh, color point to the uh, side salad to just enjoy your burger because you can't really put any more in this or else they'll fall apart that's where the monsters <laughs> and so basically so you get all your greens your your meat and your um, basically vegetables your meat all sides are good. he's still chewing still on that first Going for the second one, he's always oh, in! He's on that second bite! Tell me, what can you say right now from that bite? Wow. Man of many words. I'm not going to see this. I'm going to watch some people stand in the boat. Go Aggies! Go Aggies! Yeah, get the Aggies! Juicy burger, you really captured that. Run into the thin little patties, and I love the incorporation of it. Okay, so here's what you need to do, Ross. We need to hear about your dish. All right, um, my dish is uh, I named it Mauna Loa Chicken, and it's a uh, it's a little taste from home. And um, I'm all the way, you know, from Hawaii and me and Eddie we came here. We played football for the Aggies. And, uh, Aggies! And uh, it's just a little taste of home, and uh, we, we don't get to go to Hawaii uh, very often, and, and we miss home, and this is just a little taste of home. So um, we got uh, Hawaiian chicken, and uh, some pretty good stuff. It's uh, marinated for like, it's marinated overnight, so it's like really good uh, flavor. We use uh, a thigh because uh, it keeps the moisture in. It's really uh, juicy, it doesn't dry out. Hey. So, we're Team Shortcake. <laughs> we decided to name ourselves that because we love desserts, <laughs> which explains our cheesecake. <laughs> um, so, first of all, we started off with pork chops grilled with green chili on top of them. And we have just uh, green beans and corn that were steamed in a Everybody did really good because thank you for coming out and just thank you for coming out and cooking. And thank you everybody who voted. Thank you for voting because you know what? Your vote really did count. It made a difference. And so without further ado, fifth place, Team Shortcake. Thank you, Team Shortcake. But at least, you know, tell them what they've won. Because in fourth place, salt and pepper. <laughs> Terrific job. I personally loved the soup.
They won some baskets of stuff. I'm sure there's lots of cool stuff inside these baskets. Third place. Who wants to know? Raise your hand if you want to know. Are you sure you want to know? I don't think you want to know. They made burgers. Team Green Monster. And for Team Green Monster, what do we have? Someone yell it out. Anybody? Anybody tell me? Team Green Monster. They got Target gift cards. By the way, for second place. Target gift cards again. Higher denomination, but more money. More money. Target gift cards. More, more money. And then for first place, we have a trophy. Chef coats, embroidered head, and trophy. Okay, we have all this good stuff. I just want to say one more time though, right before we final announce, my ugly team salt and pepper. Oh. 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 So congratulations to Team Salt and Pepper. You out everybody. Now as for the judges, Woo. I would say in first place. We're just going to go with the first place. Upside down. Yeah! 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 Well, thank you everybody. This is the third Iron Chef competition to be hosted at Tulsa. Next time, we're going to do many more amazing things, and I hope that more people can come here to cook.